Hello again, Mr. Cakes here. Um, this is video number two. Um, it is 541 on this Saturday. Uh, same Saturday I did a review on Champions uh, Missile IPA. Um, what I have with me today, and this is, might be because I'm drinking out of a glass that is Smart Mouth. It's a Norfolk brewery. Um, it is in the Chelsea area of Norfolk, um, formerly known as West Ghent, uh, Norfolk. Um, but um, a great place that I like to frequent um, whenever I get a chance uh, to get out there and try, try a lot of their beers and actually drink some of my favorites. Um, and one of those favorites is one I have right here with me today, which is the G India Pale Ale. Now, Rule G is the railroad industry policy against drinking on the job. That's what it means. Um, I think it's really clever. I think their logo is 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 pretty amazing too. It's um, it's like a pint glass and a mouth. You can kind of see the tongue at the bottom there, making a face. I, I think I think they're really clever guys, and I think their um, their canning is quite unique. Um, so, anyways, uh, let's open into this guy. Okay, now the color on this one is uh, definitely more of a reddish gold hue, like a copper. Um, maybe it doesn't pour quite as clear as the, uh, the Missile um, IPA by Champion Brewing Company out of Charlottesville, but this one's definitely a little denser. Um, the head is definitely a little thicker. Seems to stand up a little more pillowy. Um, that is because of the proteins, and that will give you the, the lacing as well that you get on the inside of the glass. Um, so, um, anyways, I'm gonna give this a smell. The smell of this one is um, definitely picking up a lot of fruit. Some citrus, um, it's a little deeper, deeper scent, um, maybe a little more complex than the one I just uh, reviewed. Um, Def definitely this one's a bit more maltier right up front. I'm definitely getting the malts. Um, sweet. Um, you get the hops. It's it's certainly certainly pretty well balanced beer. Um, you can see, you know, after every sip. the way the lacing wants to cling to the glass. Um, and that is a good sign. Um, I'm not gonna say it necessarily means it is a better quality beer than some that may not provide as much of the lacing, but it's, it's due to the proteins. And um, this one's really, really good. And one thing that's nice about this beer too is it's local, so it's fresh. So um, being in Norfolk is just on the other side of the water from Portsmouth, where I am right now. Uh, this beer is incredibly fresh. I'm definitely picking up some Some green tones in there, you know. It's 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 malty. There's a little bit of a pine resin in the background. Um, definitely picking up some citrus, some fruits in there. This is delicious. Cheers. Stay tuned for my next video. Thanks.